Welcome. This is Odum Maths. And today I want us to look at graph of quadratic equation. And under it, we are looking at positive and negative values of quadratic graph. So let's use this graph as an example. This is a U-shaped graph. Okay. Now, when you talk of the positive aspect of this graph, that is the values above the x-axis, they make the y to be positive. Then for the negative, the values below the x-axis. So looking at this, we can see that the values here are from here, from this point to this point. Then below it, also from this point to this point. Okay, so per our graph, the range of values of x for which y, that is the graph, y is positive. They are two. One is here, then one is also here. So we say that um, the x values that are less than a, because the values from here downwards are all less than this a. Then all x values that are greater than c, those values here are, will, will make the graph to be positive. Okay, now the range of values of x for which y some person. Now the range of values of x for which y um, for which um, y is positive is x less than a or x greater than c. Then again, this one you can add a, this is you need to state the two because for the pieces you need the two answers. Okay, then the range of values of x for which um, y or the graph is negative. So, in that sense, those below the y and below the x axis start from A to C. They, they are not fat. So, between A and C, those values make um, y to be negative. So, we say that A less than x less than B. Okay, so let's look at this table. Now, per this table that we have, Let's look at those x values that make y negative. We see that, um, let's start from the positive. From negative 2 to negative 1, or from negative, only negative 2, and then that's of 5. These values, mix, these values of x make y to be positive. Then, for negative, from the same negative 1 to 4, we also make the y values to be negative. So, um, so per our graph, we, we can all observe that from this point to this point, the y values here are all positive. Then from this point to this point, the y values here are all positive. But from this point through to this point, the y values here are all negative. So we say that the range of values of x for which y is positive, that is between this and this. So we can say that x values that are less than um, negative 1. So we say x is less than negative 1 and x is greater than 4. So x is greater than 4. Then for the negative, we say um, from between negative 1 and 4. So Negative 1 less than x less than 4 becomes the answer. Thanks for watching and we'll meet in the next lesson. Bye.